Finding moles from grams. When you know an amount in grams of an element or of a compound or a molecule, how do you find the moles? Well, let's take for example, we have 32.0 grams of oxygen. Now, not diatomic molecules of oxygen, but just oxygen, the atom, the element. We're going to put what we are given on the left. I always put it over 1 because that makes it even with the rest of the equation. Multiply it by some sort of equality and we're going to end up with something moles. Now we would like to multiply it by something that's going to get rid of this grams. So we're going to put grams on the bottom and we want to get give us moles. So we'll put moles on the top. The equivalent we're going to use for this is going to be 16.0 grams per mole and that's coming straight from the periodic table. So we're going to put one mole here because that's implied right here would be 6 grams per one mole and right here is going to go the 16.0 grams. The grams drop out then you just divide 32 by 16 which this just comes out to 2 point zero zero moles. We're going to keep three significant figures because that's what we have in all of these other numbers.